Alrighty, Lumberjacks, welcome back to another Logging from Scratch episode. Uh, so this time around, uh, we were doing some sorting. Ooh, I should tell you guys about the loader. Um, so since the last video, uh, what am I thinking of my timeline here? So this is already out now, but uh, you guys already have the good version. So since my last video, um, I've done a few changes on the loader. One thing that we did is we made the grapple larger. It doesn't really look that much larger in comparison, but it is much larger for picking up logs, which is fantastic. Um, we added a little bit of um, some normal mapping on the body, so the reflections have a little bit of a little bit of grain and some stuff going on there to make it look a little bit more realistic. Uh, the tracks definitely have a lot more going on, so they have uh, some really nice shine to them and stuff. So we've done some, a few modifications to kind of perk it up a little bit. Um, I hope you guys are enjoying the hell out of it because uh, we did spend a lot of time getting it just right, and hopefully <coughs> that works out. Oh, you know what we should do? We should get rid of this truck. I did promise I'd drive this sucker up the hill, so we'd probably get it, better get on it. And loading it's going to be so much faster now because that new grapple is incredible. Of course, you guys are probably already experiencing that grapple because it's the one that uh, it's the one that made it out. It's funny because I'm always recording in now time for future stuff that's happening, so I have to kind of like predict what is going to be out, <laughs> if that makes any sense. So yeah. That uh, that one that you're using now is the version I'm using now, so it's not like new as of um, after that release. Because in my timeline, it hasn't actually been released yet. Uh, let's. Uh, why do I always come to this point in the road and I always forget if it's left or right? It's right. Well, if we want to go, we can always go the other way too, but we're gonna go this way. And we just gotta take it real nice and easy on these corners. So yeah, the big news was announced. I had to announce the news that we are not going to be pursuing uh, mods on console. So I figured I'd address that in this video because it was, uh, well, it would have been last week by the time you see this. that we put that news out. So we did try a whole bunch of stuff with the loader. We tried to um, find a way that Giants would allow us to put those grapples in our system onto console. And because of the memory banks or the whatever, it's not going to work out. And they don't want it that way. So, so unfortunately, uh, we are not able to bring that grapple system onto console. And because of that, if I'm not able to bring that system, it would mean I'd have to build the same noodly grapple system that is on the forwarders. Like the Buffalo and the Komatsu orders and that is a system I do not want to duplicate not even a teeny weeny bit so um, yeah I had no choice but to call it if they won't let us use the stuff we need to use to make the logging simulation experience good then unfortunately I'm not going to pursue that so oh uh, we do we do plan on still releasing maps uh, whenever we can get those done um, but that's the uh, the best you're going to get on console. So I'm sorry guys, but if you want to get into the really good logging, you guys will have to upgrade to PC land. It's uh, it's a lot of work. If we were like our own company and, you know, we had salaries and it was our job to make it, um, there might be a chance that we could pull something off, but it wouldn't be very good by the end of it. It would just be mediocre and it would be on console. But the work required to get things onto console and just dicking around and revisions and it's some it takes like months for it to get on there and it's for us on pc we have 100 percent control of when the mods come out we have 100 percent control of what is featured in the mod and there's nobody to tell us any different whether it's acceptable or not and i'm not a big fan of being told you know if a system's working the system looks good the system works good the system works better than the the design system that came with the game why not incorporate that why wouldn't you want to at least investigate it or help uh, you know, make it a better system, but there doesn't seem to be any kind of reciprocation on that from the other side, so I am stepping out, and our team is stepping out of the console realm uh, for machines, just because if we're not going to get the help and support we want from that side, then they're not going to get our mods. And sorry, unfortunately, it's, uh, it's more hurtful to the consumer than it is to them, but uh, hopefully anybody can still enjoy the stuff on PC where we uh, control everything, and we can set our own Set our own pace for releases and not worry about, you know, getting tied up in all the other what can and can't do kind of stuff. So, 
So yeah, anyway, that decision's been made by the team. So all future stuff for machines and equipment-wise will be all done on PC. Should be, uh, should be better. Not like we've ever had any, uh, stuff on console anyway, so it's not like a big, uh, a big surprise or anything. See this like vertical line? What's it? Oh, I see what it is. It's my exhaust, I think. I was like, why is there a vertical line on the ground? But I just realized I'm pretty sure that's the exhaust. I think it's the exhaust. Maybe it's not. What am I looking at here? No, it's over there. What is that? Like shadows or something? I don't know. I'm seeing things, guys. I'm seeing things. There we go. So we're dealing with tax time again up here in Canada land. It's that time of the year. I'm really not excited about my taxes. Apparently some stuff didn't work right on my taxes last year, so I got a bill from the government for $1,600 that I owe them from last year, which is great because we're two months away from getting hit with like a $6,000 bill from them. So I'm really glad that they saved that for now. <laughs> taxes suck. There's no point in even making any money. You might as well just go on welfare. What's the point? Oh my god, how much do we make? Oh, 22,000 again. It seems to be the most you can really hold on this is somewhere between 20 and... So it'd be 24,000 for that load. That's not too bad. We did pack that one up pretty darn good, though. We threw a lot of stuff on there. And I can't wait till we're up top here and plucking from our field. That'll be so much better. Uh, oop. All right, let's get back down there. See how fast we can get down there. We did in almost two minutes at one time, but we'll see. So yeah, paying taxes. Trying to deal with console integration, which didn't happen. Paying taxes, what hasn't happened. It's not been a super great start to January, I'm not gonna lie. Or a start to the new year anyway. But, you know what? We did get the loader out, so that's good. That's probably the most successful thing that's happened this year so far. Just getting that loader all said and done. And we have a lot of more things we're working on, so... So if you guys aren't patrons, uh, we're going to be updating a lot of stuff about the models we're building on there. So if you feel like you want to donate... I think you can even donate a dollar and still see the posts. But, yeah, lots of cool projects upcoming. Pretty exciting stuff. It does take a lot of time to get everything rolling, but now that we got some... Now that we got that one loader body done, um, it should be a lot easier to incorporate, like, new stuff. For sure. My wacko driving. We're really just hauling down this hill. Hey, look at us go. Try to drive from this view because it looks slightly less sketchy. I use the term slightly, very loosely. Let's go across this field. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking about doing, I don't know if I mentioned this or not, I can't remember one day to the next year anymore. I'm thinking about doing like a very realistic series um, on Grizzly Mountain. So, very realistic, planning, um to do everything, no tabbing between machines, you know, you have to drive your machine to your site, that kind of thing. Uh, just keeping everything very realistic, having like your house or something, or a camp, um, something like that. I'm, I'm thinking about it, I don't know, I don't know how good I'd be at doing, the, I'm not like getting too extreme into role playing or anything like that, so I don't know how good I'd be at uh, keeping it super real. As a person who mods this game, it's hard to be right on the money for realism, but, um, I don't know. Might be fun. We could try it. I'll, I might just do a couple episodes and try it out and see how I feel about it. And if it starts getting a little too weird, then maybe we'll get out of that. Alright, so let's shimmy shamble this guy over a little. There's some, there's some things in there. There we go. So, I don't want to put the tops on yet, because the tops are bad, so... Oh yeah, right, I got my pedals now. What the hell am I doing driving around like an idiot? Oh. You don't quite fit in there just yet. This is 
put this up here. Where's my track anyway? Oh, we're kind of right in the sauce here. I swear to God, buddy, I'm going to put a log on top of your car if you honk at me one more time. And he's just asking for it, hey? Sir, you know what you're going to get? See, we're, we're not... Oops. What is happening? Oh, I, uh, I forgot my cab bumped into the pile there. That's okay. I'm going to literally throw this piece of wood at this car. Here, got this right for you. Smash! I gotta take a picture of that because that's hilarious. And that's what you get. I should have built a fort around him. That's That would have been more accurate. Anyway, let's get back to it here. So yeah, as you notice, the uh, claw is definitely a lot larger than it was before. Well, it's not like a lot larger. It's like maybe 10% larger, but you can get a lot more in grapple. The uh, grapple is actually a lot heavier too than it was in the previous episodes. Um, we found a way to... I found a way to make it so the um, the weight could be a bit higher, but the uh, the physics didn't cause the grapple to freak out. And didn't cause the logs to shoot out neither, so that's good. And I'm just going to kind of pencil it here just to keep the load kind of uniform. Maybe not 100% uniform, but kind of uniform. Let's go with that. There we go. I love loading. One of my favorite things to do. I've only said that probably like 500 times on 900 different episodes, but still, it is pretty great. Now, I want to load this truck up more if we can. Because now that we got it separated, we should be able to put these pieces in here a lot nicer. Because the problem before was just those tops were causing such a scene. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, lost one. Bad penciling. Josh is actually in the process of making some other grapples for us here too, so... That should be kind of fun. We got this, uh, this guy comes out with the, uh, or came out with the, uh, loader. Um, it's kind of just the basic, I think we called it the LG-1. It's the only thing we did kind of give mystical names to is the grapples. Machines are a brand name, but the grapples were like, eh, let's just call them a, a made-up name. We gotta have a little bit of creativity in here, too. And really, it's a grapple, like, who cares? It's not like we're calling it the, uh... Stealing the name and changing it to something else. Uh, 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 mm -mm. Actually, uh, Josh has made a uh, three by four. Oops, uh, three by four claw for grapples. Right. Oops. Oh, I guess someone's lost forever. There we go. Oh. Whoops, jeez. It's gotta be gentle. I want two. Not one, but two. I want these two right there. Perfect. Those will fit right in there, just where I want them. There we go. I can actually, you know what, probably put some in the middle too if I really wanted to. Three, three seems like much. Let's do two. Because I bet these two will just fit. Cool. Let's take a cheap shot here. Oh, we even have room for like a couple more in there. Actually, we should grab this one now that we're in cheat mode here. 
I just gotta be careful because now the uh, machines have physics everywhere now, which I'm not used to. There we go. We'll call that bunk kid. Well, of course, these guys are blocking the road now, so... Let's see how, let's see how far we can get up here. Oops. Realism, right here. And like it went right in that little spot. <laughs> Does it actually have collisions in there? No. No, it doesn't. Okay. That's a. That's interesting. To say the least. All right. So, uh, anyway, moving on. Back to work here. I just thought that looked pretty interesting, so worth it. Uh, let's grab some of these. These are good logs, aren't they? They are, yep. Yeah. We can actually pencil on the highway. It'll probably be easier right behind the trailer because nobody's around. There we go. And whoop. And we'll grab one of these. Actually, not too too bad of logs. See if we can kind of shimmy these back a little here. Did you miss any? Oh, just these ones. One thing about having a taller grapple, it's just uh, when you get close, it's harder to manipulate stuff. We also left everything kind of in the middle of the road where the stumps are here too, so that probably doesn't help. Use our light. It's a little bright. But oh, whatever, we'll use it. It's a lag. I wonder if it's from the light sometimes. Who knows? Probably just because there's so much going on physics wise here. Oops, easy dog. Sorry, I'm like super focused on uh, grabbing this stuff here. Just speed up time. I actually did that on one of my own videos. I don't usually, I, think, I do not usually watch my own videos because it just feels weird listening to my own voice. Um, but I was checking out one that somebody said the audio was messed up on. And then I don't know how, sometime, some button I pushed or something, but caused it to go like super fast. And I was like, blah, 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 and I was like, what the hell? It's so weird. Hearing your own voice on a recording is weird enough, but hearing it while it's uh, in fast forward, even weirder. I bet, look at that. Zap that pile together. We... I bet we can actually get some of those uh, tops on here, too. It's a really messy load job, though. Let's see if I can flatten it out a little here. Even if I can make like a cradle in the middle kind of thing, it doesn't have to be super crazy. That's well, kind of cradly. Here we. Oops. I kind of want these shorts from over here. I'm always using my uh, joystick, or my. I'm always using my uh, keyboard. I don't know why. It's just like a go-to button now for me. I have no idea if we can get all this on there. But we can sure as heck try. That's the way I look at it. Let's just. Or plunk that nasty looking load right there. Oh, 
I just noticed one of my grapple things has got an issue. Wonder. I'm gonna have to take a look at that. Luckily for you guys, this mod technically isn't out yet in my time, so let's take a look real quick. We can see what's happening here. Bit of a gap there. Ah, I see what's happening. Oh, weird. It got all funky in there. That's okay. Luckily, we're modders and we can fix that, so I know exactly how to do that. So by the time you guys get this, that won't be there. <laughs> that I promise. Boop. And we'll tuck this guy in here. And this one over here. Perfect. I don't think we'll get any more on there, so we'll just actually leave that. Shut her down. And... Yeah, it actually doesn't look too bad. Let's lock that whole thing up. I'm just going to get this thing off the road temporarily, because we'll have to drive it up there in the next video. Parker right here. Beauty. Can I cargo by? Oh, <laughs> probably not because that stick it probably sees. I should just leave it there and make you stay there, you silly driver. Come ahead if you dare. Wish you could flip off. Where's the flip off button? Really? You can't get past that, hey? Man, there's. Man, that guy right there. Try a chainsaw. Oh, I do have a chainsaw. Perfect. Ah! Realism. It's through your head. Anyway, okay, I better pull the loader ahead just a teeny bit. Loader blocking traffic. Gotta love this loader. It's a work of art, gentlemen. Anyway, uh, oh my god, we're way over our video time. Okay, guys, I'm gonna cut it off here. On the next video, we're gonna keep piling on the logs, man. We still got a bit to clean up. Not a lot, but at least another two loads, probably. I don't know... Yeah, probably about two loads. So, yeah. Uh, if you guys liked the video, leave a like, leave a comment. Do not forget to subscribe. And if you're in the bush, don't forget to hug a tree. All right, guys, we'll catch you on the next one. See ya.